Hello everyone and welcome back to Going On Caffeine. My name is Isaac and the mod list has been released for Attack of the B-Team. The people over at Technic have released the server files, which means like people who own servers and admins and stuff can set up the servers for all their friends to play and all that. Uh, as soon as the mod pack's released, but it also means that we have been given a full mod list of all the mods that are going to be available in Attack of the B-Team when it launches in a couple of hours now. And I'm going to run through those real quick in a minute. But the first thing I want to do is kind of clear up the early access thing that's going on around Attack of the B-Team because a few people seem to be a bit confused in my last video in the comment section about um, when it's going to be released to everybody and what early access actually means and what you get when you donate $5 um, to Child's Play. So what's going to go? What's going to happen is if you donate the $5 to Child's Play, you will receive uh, early access to the mod pack today at uh, 8 p.m. in the UK, which is 3 p.m. Eastern Time, and I think about noon 12-ish Pacific Time, possibly, maybe, because things. It might be. I'm not, I'm not too sure. Don't quote me on that. You can look it up. But um, that's what happens if you donate the $5. If you don't donate the $5, the pack becomes available to the public on the 3rd of February. So it's like it's only a few, a few days behind, four days. But um, you don't, you're not going to get it until the 4th of February. So if you do want to play it today or over this weekend, uh, you're going to have to donate at least $5 to Child's Play. Uh, I'll put a link in the description to the, um, the the donation page on the Techie website. You can go there if you want. And you can like um, get early access. Let's get on to the mod packs. So they've got they've kind of gone off mainstream, which I, th I think like a lot of the packs are doing nowadays. So like, there's no build craft, which I was quite surprised at. Like, there's no industrial craft, um, which I wasn't too surprised at. Industrial craft hasn't been in a tech it pack for a while now. Um, but so there's not a, a lot of like mainstream packs. They've gone with a lot of packs. I've a lot of uh, mods even that I've not really ever heard of. Um, but I'm sure it'll be really fun. They sound really cool. I'm gonna run through these in a second, and you'll be. Uh, You'd be surprised at some of these. They do sound really fun. So just to pick out a few of these ones that I think are going to be really cool. This is one called World of Dinos. <laughs> this is one called Tropicraft, which sounds pretty cool. Uh, you've got Statues, Minions. We've got <laughs> Food Plus, which sounds all right. We've got Hamster Hamsterific. Hamsterific sounds pretty scary. <laughs> uh, Random Things is pretty cool. We've got Project Red, which is a replacement for uh, Red Power from 1.4, I think it was. Maybe. Uh, we've also got some of the old favourites that have not left. We've got Thermal Expansion, we've got Mine Factory Reloaded, and we've got Tinker's Construct, which have all been in stuff before. Um, there's a mod, there's a, the mod called Morph is in here, which is a really fun mod. If you haven't played with that, that is really fun. Let's just morph into different animals and mobs and stuff. Really cool mod. Uh, we've also got Galacticraft, which is always fun, and Galacticraft planets, so we'll be able to go to Mars and possibly other planets in the future. And other ones like Qcraft, which they like to put into uh, the stuff, and as always. So, without further ado, let's go into this. So, we've got Advanced to Genetics, which uh, I think was in Feed the Beast Horizons pretty recently. I didn't get a chance to play it, but that looks pretty cool. You get to um, take, like, features from a mod, like maybe a creeper or a cow. Um, a creeper or a cow, as if I went from creeper to cow. Um, like, if you took a creeper, you could blow up, or if you took, it like, a chicken, for, for instance. A chicken's probably a better idea, a better example. If you take a chicken, you can sort of get the genetics of the chicken, and then you'll get that sort of slow fall effect. Like, if you throw a chicken off a cliff, they sort of just, like, like float down really slowly. And you can get that effect onto your character, which is really cool, actually. And uh, the next one on the list is Archimedes Ship Mod, which is... Uh, we did a mod spotlight on that a long time ago now, actually, I think, when it came out. But it like, basically lets you build ships and fly around and stuff. It's quite cool. They're not, they're, like, they're not like jet pilot ships. They're just sort of like wooden airships, like boats in the sky, almost. <laughs> uh, Artifice, I'm not sure what that is, but I'm pretty sure it's been in quite a few mods before now. We've got Auto Blocks, uh, Auto Utils. Uh, Biomes Plenty is not not an uncommon one. Carpenter's Blocks, never heard of that either. Chisel. Uh, Dragon Mounts sounds pretty cool. I'm not sure what Dragon Mounts is. It could either be like mounts, like you can mount your weapons or something on a wall. Or it could be like a mountain that holds a dragon or a mountain that was once owned by a dragon and has some sort of dungeon in it. I don't know. Or it could be something completely different to that and I could just be making stuff up based on what this looks like. I haven't actually looked up the mods, so there you go. <laughs> we've got Enhanced Core, we've got Enhanced Portals, that sounds pretty cool. We've got uh, Extended Renderer for Minecraft 1.6.4, that sounds like it could be useful actually. <laughs> we've got uh, Flans Mod, uh, f Food Plus Mod, which means like I think they go for like a farming sort of thing there maybe. Maybe? With food? Possibly? <laughs> well done, Isaac. <laughs> We've got uh, Fossil Sarge. So Fossil Sarge? Yeah, that's what it says. Fossil Sarge reported. Uh, version 1.0.2. We've got the Furniture Mod, the Galacticraft, Galacticraft Planets, uh, Liquid XP, which is a pretty cool mod, uh, Map Writer, uh, Mike McDoodle Car, which is just like a, a car mod that you won't like, see used. Uh, my Factory Reloaded, Minions. We've got the NIE plugins. Of course, not enough items on there, so everyone can search up all the stuff they want. <laughs> Uh, we've got Necromancer, Natura, Morph Beta, which is quite pre uh, Morph Beta, which is pretty cool. Uh, mod Build for Minecraft 1.6.4. I'm not sure what that is. Mod Build. <laughs> we've got uh, not enough items, obviously. Open Blocks, Open Mod Silb, 
Uh, we've got open blocks, we've got a Power Crystals Core, we've got Project Red, and then like a bunch of other Project Reds. There's Project Red Base, Project Red Compact, Project Red uh, Integration, Project Red Lightning, or Lighting even, sorry. Uh, Project Red Mechanical, Project Red World. <laughs> There's like a bunch of them. Uh, I'm just going to run through these last ones real quick because this is dragging on a little bit. We've got QCraft, Random Things, Saints Pack, Secret Rooms Mod. Secret Rooms Mod's awesome, I'm not going to lie. Uh, Statues, Tropic Craft, uh, World of Dinosaurs, Trail Mix, <laughs> Witchery sounds pretty cool, Thermal Expansion, Weather Mod, I'm a bit dubious about unless it gets rid of rain i'm not i'm not sure if i'm feeling it too much uh tinker's construct is awesome as always there's a, mon a mod called sync i'm not too sure what that is there's a uh, whaler which is what am i looking at which shows you that little thing at the top of your screen kind of like i think it does the same thing as nie tooltips where it just shows you what you're looking at uh and then there's a mod called waypoints as well which i'm not too sure what that's about a mod called waypoints i mean i know there's one actually now i'm thinking about it where's hmm there's no uh what's it called there's no map on there is it maybe waypoints is the map that's used in uh in attack of the b team possibly i haven't actually seen the uh there's no maps in it there's no like raise mini map or zans mini map so you never know it could be waypoints could be a new map that they're using for attack of the b team you never know but there you go that is the mod list for the new attack of the b team mod pack that is coming out later tonight at 8 p.m in england that is uh 3 p.m eastern time and 1 p.m pacific maybe possibly uh be sure to stick around i am gonna have a video up later tonight it comes at 8 p.m so i could probably have one up before nine possibly maybe at nine uh in the uk so stick around for that and i you'll be able to see that video be able to see me play it for the first time ever for the first like 20 minutes possibly um but yeah thanks for watching if you did enjoy the video be sure to hit a like and i will see you guys next time Bye bye